Okay, so as you can see, we did some updates here on the Aries. It's got a new uh, emblem, Aries logo, and um, it's got the new seven inch touchscreen with uh, three black anodized buttons for power, standby, and reset. And um, we're gonna turn this on here. So that's the new intro I designed and that has the um, speaker in there. So you heard that uh, when it turns on uh, this page here. We really didn't do too much to it. Let's get in here a little bit. I didn't do too much to this page. So we're gonna leave this alone for now. Um, we did change a lot of things here on the template. We added uh, different style buttons for the bands got your antenna to reset okay uh, resets gonna be working now right now I, I gotta do some coding for that and this so as soon as we have uh, options for those buttons we'll do that call sign uh, the progress bars and the temp bar I have changed so you'll see that in a second your volt, current, SWR, power output, temp, are all in check. If one of these go into trouble, they'll say fault. Which I will redesign all that. I also added a slider for your brightness. You can lower it down. And then you could drag the Aries logo and make it brighter. We'll make it a little bit lower for the video. There we go. Uh, also added a scroller across the air. It says uh, Aries LDMOS HF amplifier. I am 2 MDX. And then I'll show you some other things I did inside. I did some more updates as well. Uh, but let me show you these, these progress bars, these skins I made for the progress bars. As you know, I'm, I like to do the skins for Thetis, so I just decided to incorporate that here on the Aries. Um, okay, so we're on 80 meters right now. Let's put this in operate. And uh, we'll give it some chatter. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Hello, Rio. One, two, MDX. One, two, three, four. As you can see there, the red ring when you transmit. Uh, if you could see the progress bars, how they change. They got a 3D look and a smooth transition in color and gradient. And two, MDX. And two, MDX. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Hello, radio. One, two, three, four, test. One, two, three, four, test. Hello, one, two, three, four. As it gets, it gets more and more, you'll see it actually peak up more and more. Um, now you hear the fan kicking in. One, two, three, four, test. One, two. Okay. Like I said, we're on 80, so there's really nobody on here. Uh, as this grows, the temperature, it'll go from yellow to an orange to a red as you're getting hot. All right. So you see the temp getting up higher here. And then starting to go orange, And it starts to uh, top off a little bit and come back down. I have a temperature temperature controlled fan in here now. Let me just pop this lid and have you guys take a look inside. It's um, I got a temperature controller in here now, which controls the Scorpion Crossflow fan. Or I'm about to show you. So right now we added a temp, and if you look over here on the copper spreader, you got two probes. One is for the front display temp and the other one's for that temp over there. 
as you can see right in here, this is the force flow scorpion fan. It spins like a roller. Also, I upgraded, I made design my own blower package with 3D printed 30 millimeter fans that blow straight down onto the LD Moss. And you got two more fans back here, and then one more up front, right there. So a lot of airflow in here. So there you go. back on here. Do another test. And two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and two and the X, and two and the X. Testing one, two, three, four. Smooth progress bars here, nice 3D finish. Hello. Two, 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 one, two, three, four, five, six. Hello, hello. Now, you see how fast these progress bars are moving? We're actually going to change that and we're going to make them more slower, I guess you could say. And um, there you go. So then, just make a little bit more. I think this is a little too quick. I was talking to uh, my buddy Demetrius about that, so we're going to slow them down. Just so they look more, I guess, accurate. It's going to be interesting. So there you go, that's the updates on the Aries. I hope you like it, I love it. It looks really, really good. All right guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it, and to MDX.